Minecraft. The game seems very simplistic at first, but then you realize later on, you're wrong. There's a lot more to this game that meets the eye. You can use it to express yourself through these satisfying builds. You could have adventures with your friends. You can do skits, stories. As long as you have your imagination, what you can do with Minecraft is endless. This game came out in 2011, and there wasn't really much to it back then. And a year later, they released a version for consoles, the Xbox 360 edition. And people really loved the Legacy editions. Things were going great. And then a certain corporation that we know had to shut it down. Well, let me tell you that there is a way to revive the Legacy Console Edition through mods. Because <laughs> I've seen people like Dan TDM, Vicstar, and a few others playing the Legacy Edition growing up, and I thought I'd try to recreate the experience for myself. Make sure to like and subscribe, and we're gonna get started. I feel stupid now but yeah like i was saying like this game is pretty relaxing like there's something about the old music that just that just really really puts your mind at ease wait a minute there are planks up there hold on silly me yeah lately i've been re-watching the legacy edition series for Dan TDM, Big Star, a bit of Stampy Lawn Nose. And once I saw this mod recreates that experience, I figured figured this would be right up my alley. So that's why I decided to do this series. Normally I don't really do these let's play type series, but this is one that I really felt compelled to do. Get out of the hole, villager. Get out of my hole. Get out of my stone hole. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's why I thought. This hole will only be penetrated by me. God, the way I worded that sounded so wrong. <laughs> I'm stupid. Anyway, let's get to having a little bit of fun. First, I'm gonna have to sleep so that the mobs of the night get, don't get me. And the fact that you can left trigger to like do a shield, unlike Bedrock where you have to crouch to use it. I mean, like the shield is actually functional in this, which I am so happy about. Like, my main complaint about Bedrock is that, that you have to crouch to use the shield. Alright. Perfect. Now let's turn it all into bread. Perfect, I got the midnight munchies. Oh, perfect. A little bit more iron. Efficiency free, you know, I'll take that. The dune armor trim is kind of enchanted golden apple. That is perfect. A notch apple is just perfect, chat. Like, my God. Like, I did not expect this, and yet I am not complaining one bit. All right, let's see. Oh, there's another one over there. God damn. You know, I'll go to this one first and then go to the other one. Just cuz. 
Like, this is a great way to start off the series, just raiding temples. I mean, there's just not really too much to them, but honestly, that's okay. There's something about vanilla temples that just has charm. You know what I mean? You know what? I might grab some of these cactus. Just because some green dye will be useful for some builds. Plus, I think it'd be funny to, like, build a, a giant Luigi just to get Bella all flustered. Like, I just, I just think that's going to be very hilarious. Yeah, she gets all flustered when we talk about who she simps for, and then there's me who's like, Oh, yes. Give it to me, baby. Alright, got some gunpowder. Couple golden apples. There's not really as much in here, but... but I'll still take some some bones. Some bones and gunpowder and stuff. Boom, boom. I wonder, w would there be another temple nearby if I l look? Oh, I think I see another, I think I see another village. I'm not completely sure. Yep, that's a building of another village. Well, I knew I'd find an another temple. At first, I wasn't sure about spawning here, but then I realized... But then I realized this is a, this is actually a pretty good spawn. Hopefully there's something out of the village or like at, le at least like a blacksmith or something. I would really love it there. There would be like more iron and stuff. Just save me the trouble. Uh, I doubt that's going to be the case. Wonder what buildings are up here. Or if it's just the one over here. Yeah, th let's go. We. Oh, I see the Badlands over here. You know, I'll worry about getting armored dogs later on. What I need to worry about is getting out of this, getting out of this desert and getting some resources. I'm just curious to see if there is a, there would be a, oh, there's an, there's another temple. Wait here, camel. Efficiency five. Yo, I'll take that. I'll fucking take that. My God, that, that is fantastic, actually. This is actually like this is actually a great run. 
Yeah, I wish you could put armor on a camel. Actually, I take it back because armored camels would look ridiculous. At least horses, it makes sense. You not know, stay right here and rest. A regular golden apple. Boom. Bedtime. Gotta go fast. Oh, yeah, this is happening. Ponder and sing. You know what? I'm I'm good with that. Those two are easily some of my favorite favorite goat horns. I knew this was gonna was not gonna happen, but if I did get tried and right off the bat, then I'd be be like Jesus Christ. Like that would be just absolutely insane. But hey, this is Minecraft. They always got nerfed me somehow. <laughs> yes, now I have enough. I think it's time we head out and find a different place to explore because honest honestly we're not even close to the biomes i want to build in so or at least i don't think so because personally i want to build in the spruce biome or at least close to one and the dark oak it can always just get the saplings so I can start farming that. Wait, why am I in my Waluigi skin? <laughs> I just realized. And you know what? I do not care. Because cause it's Waluigi. I mean, just look at this handsome devil over here. Yeah, like one of the main focuses for ne yeah, next episode will be Objectives will be one. Uh. Start building the house. Two, mine for resources. And, and three, get started on some farms. Leave a comment for what you all want me to do next. Give me some ideas that stays true to nostalgia of OG Minecraft. Okay, I got almost half the leather I need. So good progress so far. Yeah, I know this first episode's a little bit slow, but it'll heat up the next episode when there's more more stuff going on. So the fact that I've raided so many, I've raided so many temples is crazy. Is there anything in here that I need to get rid of? And I already have plenty of gunpowder. Honestly, I need the seeds more than anything else as of right now. Might as well get rid of the extra. Like, here's the plan for the series. We're going to do everything. I'm going to do everything in my power to recreate the nostalgic experience of console Minecraft. And then... And then I'll end off the series by fighting the Ender Dragon. Make it a poetic ending. Make the end truly be the end. Like the next episode, when we're all so, then I'll tell you what I plan for the series. Like y'all never know. I could be building my own town like Dan TDM, or I could just build my own my own tower. Oh 
it's true. I just need two more, and then then I have enough for all the bookshelves. Well, I'll be damned. The only thing that will be missing is the sugar cane. I mean, I I do have like a stack here, but but I'll probably need to farm farm a bit of it. Oh, there they are. Come here, cowie wowies. Give me your leather. Rah! Give me your leather. Oh, Minecraft dogs. First things first. Come here, pupper. Yeah! Yeah! All right, let's get another one. Yeah! Dog army's off to a good start. Yeah! Yeah! Six doggos. Come with me, little buddies. Good doggos, good doggos. Help me harvest for leather. Help me harvest for leather. For the leather. <laughs> I get a little bit quirky at night, as you can clearly tell. The class clowns do get a bit quirky at night. <laughs> Let's go back to our adventure. Let's go get. Let's get back to our adventure, shall we? Me and my eight doggos going in on an adventure. Just wait, these eight dogs will eventually grow into a giant dog army. Once that happens, oh, things are gonna get fun. Oh, Dark Oak, that's perfect. It may not be a spruce biome, but hey, you know what? I'll take it. Yes, we're building a beach house. We're building a nice beach house. Oh, and there's spruce right there. Actually, yes, this is where I'm gonna settle. <laughs> 